Just a quick example of how to use tracking to report on a profit and loss per client so you can get an overall view of your business as well as go into more granular detail on a per client basis. So what we've got to do is set up tracking. And the first place we go is to settings, general settings. We go to tracking. We just drop down here and we'll just get rid of that for the moment. And we'll add a tracking category and we'll call it clients and we'll call this one ABC company, the next one Best Plumbing, and you would set them up for each of your clients along the way, and we'll have my cafe in here as well. So we've got three clients in there. We'll just save there. So we've got three clients set up. The next point is we've got to go and set up some, we're going to set up some costs, some cost categories for those because we want these to show in indirect costs. So what we're going to do is we're going to add an account and it's going to be a direct cost. So it's showing in here under the cost of goods sold. So we'll call this 310 and this business is doing some marketing, internet marketing for businesses. So we'll have article costs. In there, we'll label payments to the account. It's got GST on it. And we'll set up another account under direct costs. We'll call this one 320 and we'll call it video. Video production. We'll enable payments. So now we've got these accounts set up. You can see here under purchases, under video, so we've got article costs and video production. So next, let's just go and see how that actually works. So we'll go to accounts, we'll go to sales in the first instance. And we're gonna create a new invoice. We're gonna create a new invoice and we're gonna break this one to ABC uh, Company, which is your new client. Sites so due and anything. Video production one, and we're going to charge two hundred dollars for that. We'll put to sales, and the client is to ABC Company. There we go. We'll hit approve. Now what we're going to do is we've incurred some costs in relation to ABC uh, company. So we're just going to create a new purchase here. And this is from the, the video production company. And they have sent us an invoice for their and we're going to put it to the video production and we're going to allocate it to the ABC company. We'll just hit approve on that. And totals do not match. We'll change that to tax inclusive. Approve. Now we can go to the reports. And we can compare clients. And there we have ABC Company. We've had sales of 200 and we've got the costs associated with that. So we've got a profit and loss per client.